Hey folks, Chad with uh, Flyway Farm USA. Couldn't remember who I was. Anyway, showing you the 250 gallon compost tea brewer that I copied off a commercial available unit. And uh, obviously didn't copy exactly like that because they use stainless steel and, and uh, boy, they have a really nice unit. But uh, I have no idea what the price tag is on that. I just know it's sure it's out of my budget. So anyway, I had the, uh, the tote available and it's a clean tote and I just modified it as I could to make this thing work. Right now this is the first batch of the season. This is actually worm tea and uh, you can see my input from my compressor right there into the cap. This is one inch PVC. First down uh, pipe goes to a valve and to the turbulator which is right here. This is actually just a uh, floor drain and it's upside down forms a little bowl, forms a little air pocket underneath there. With this valve I can switch, I can switch from overall aeration to aeration coming through this bag. So this, uh, this strainer is actually paint strainers, you've seen them before I'm sure, but uh, five gallon specifically. And um, anyway, all the worm castings went into this strainer and are now strapped to the bottom of this bowl. And then there's a pipe that goes down through the center of this, about, I don't remember how much it was, 12 inches or so, maybe a little more. And it's got capped off at the bottom, it's got holes in it, and so now the airflow goes down through it, bubbles back up through the uh, substrate, stripping the fungi and the uh, beneficial bacteria all the bacteria um, off of the, uh, off the substrate there. So right now my weak point is air pressure. I'll show you the compressor here in a minute, but I can't run both the turbulator and the overall aeration. I don't have enough pressure for it. So I'll kind of run back and forth. So I'll switch back and you'll start to see it turbulate pretty good, aerating before and aft. So that's what the second pipe goes to the base of the unit and has uh, kind of forks off underneath with uh, holes drilled in the PVC for the aeration. So, the compressor right now is just a little $2.50 garage sale uh, fine, little, uh, airbrush basic compressor, and it's doing the job. But I definitely want, especially if I start putting compost through here, where I've got more and more bacteria, I definitely want the aeration to, uh, to come up several notches. So a uh, hot tub or spa blower will get that done for me. So anyway, I don't know what cost I've got into it. The, uh, the tote itself was free. PVC, I probably got less than, less than 30 bucks in things. So uh, pretty easy to make. Hopefully it's gonna um, do its job. I've got a microscope that I'll put this uh, stuff underneath of and uh, maybe give an update to see what it looks like. And, um, and I think it will work. So there you go.